Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics. Today we have an interesting integral. What is the undefined integral of x squared all over 1 minus x to the power 100 dx? On the first side, this integral is really hard because we have a huge power, we have 100 power, we have a denominator, we have denominator, we have a fraction. So what do I recommend to do in this case? So let's make a substitution. So 1 minus x will be our t. So 1 minus x equal to t. And from here, x equal to 1 minus t. This is our x from here. So, and right here, let's find our dx. So, dx will be equal to the derivative of this 1 minus x, 1 minus t, which is equal to minus dt. Just find derivative of this t, because right here we have 0. So, we find all of these elements, and let's put all of these elements, all of these changes inside of our integral that we have in the beginning. So what integral we will have? We will have that, we will have of course minus behind of this because minus dt, I write this minus bef behind this integral, and in integral we will have x square, but x equal to 1 minus t, so we will have 1 minus t square in our denominator. And in our denominator we will have 1 minus x which is equal to t, we will have t to the power 100, t to the power 1 and of course dx equal to dt to minus dt, but I bring this minus behind of this integral, so multiplying by dt, which is equal to. So what we're going to do next? Let's raise this 1 minus t to the second power, we will have minus integral, in our denominator we will have a classic case, we will have t square minus 2t and plus 1. And if we multiply this by minus 1, we will have an interesting case, so t to the power 100 dt, and let's multiply this denominator by this minus. We will have that integral, we will have minus t square plus 2t and minus 1. Minus one. So this will be our denominator, and right here we will have the same denominator, t to the power 100 dt. So why, why I multiply this by minus and why I raise this to the second power? If we divide in this by parts, so we can divide t square by t to the power 100 plus 2t divided to the t power 100 and minus 1 divided to the power t 100, we will have an interesting case. So let's divide these by, by parts. So as a result we will have the integral of the... we have minus dividing t square by t to the power 100, we will have t to the power minus 98. And let's make this the same step. We will have plus 2t divided by t to the power 100. We will have plus 2t, but not to the power 100. We bring this to our denominator. 1 minus 100, we will have minus 99. And the last step, minus t to the power 100. I bring this t to the power 100 to our denominator. And we will have minus t to the power minus 100. And dt. As you can see, we have simple cases, we have a table cases, we have a power, we need to add one and divide it by this power. We have integral of sum, we need to find integral all of these parts. So this will be equal to, let's find all of this integral. The first one, we will have minus t to the power, we add one, minus 97, and divide it by this, minus 97. So this is the integral of this. And let's go right here, so what we will have plus, we will have plus 2t to the power, we add 1, we will have only minus 98, and we divide it by this, minus 98. And let's go right here, adding 1, we will have minus t to the power minus 99, and we divide it by this, minus 99. So really complicated, but we simplify this right now, so as a result we will have that this minus and this minus we can cancel and bring this 97 to the other denominator. So as a result we will have 1 over 97 t to the power 97. This is our first expression. Take a look right here. We will have the final sign, we will have minus. We can cancel this 98 with this 2, we will have 49 in our denominator and not t to the power minus 98, but we bring this 
98 to the power to the denominator and we will have t to the power 98 with the plus sign and of course minus in our nominator. This is our second expression. And the third expression, this minus and this minus, will give us a plus and we bring this minus power to the denominator and we will have plus 1 over 99 t to the power 99 and plus c and this will be our integral but we have had a substitution that our t is equal to 1 minus x so this is not the final answer we need to change this t by this x. So as a result we'll have our final answer is that our integral will be equal to 1 over 97 times 1 minus x to the power 97. This is the first expression, just change it t by 1 minus x because we had a substitution. Minus 1 over 49 times 1 minus x to the power 98 and the last one plus 1 raised to the power divided by to the power 99 and t is equal to 1 minus x 1 minus x to the power 99 and plus c so this is our final answer this is our integral if you have any question if you have any suggestion write your suggestion in a comment write your answer in a comment thank you for watching subscribing See you in the next videos.